protect you. So you understand? I understand. In the movie Rogue One, a Star Wars story, Jin Erso is a smart, spunky, chip on her shoulder daughter of a brilliant scientist who tried to escape the clutches of the Empire. But instead, he was forced back into service when Jin was just a tyke. And while she was left to grow up as an orphan in a backwater corner of the galaxy, he was hauled off to help complete a nightmarish project, the Emperor's fearsome Death Star, a weapon capable of destroying entire worlds. Years later, Jin finds herself locked up on one of the Empire's prison planets. But instead of being left there to rot, she's unexpectedly freed by a team of Rebel Alliance agents. When was the last time you were in contact with your father? What is this? The Rebels have learned of her father's involvement in the Death Star project, and they're desperately hoping Jin might somehow help them locate her dad and his super weapon plans. There isn't much time. This latest Star Wars prequel once again swoops into an action adventure in a galaxy far, far away. And the film is packed to the brim with daring do, lightsaber swinging bravery, self-sacrifice, and a valiant push against evil. May the force be with us. Now there is, however, enough blazing and cold-blooded violence here to fill a TIE fighter or two, and some force-focused spirituality that parents should be aware of. So I'll be giving Rogue One three and a half robot sidekicks out of five for family friendliness. For the full review, check out PluggedIn.com. Plugging you into the movies, I'm Bob Walaszewski for Focus on the Family's Plugged In Movie Review.